Good day, my dear research students. This time, I will teach you how to transfer your questionnaire created in MS Word to Google Forms. First, you have to be ready with your survey questionnaire in MS Word. I guess all of you have submitted this one uh, last semester in our research one subject. I just added some two questions, uh, sections rather, here in uh, the survey questionnaire. The first section is um, the introduction, and the second section is the informed consent. The informed consent is part of our ethics considerations. Uh, this part will allow this, the respondents to give consent to participate in the research survey. Okay? So now you open your Gmail account. You can use either your ordinary Gmail, your personal Gmail, or you can also use your LCCDO email. Once you have opened, you go to Google Drive, click in this area, Google Apps, then Google Drive. Okay, so once you open your Google Drive, uh, go here, My Drive, More, the Google Forms, blank form so after you created your blank form so first we are going to give a title this form for example uh, research survey because uh, this title is very important it will be the name of the form that will be saved in your google drive so once you open this form to edit, you can just go to Google Drive, uh, look for this name there, and double click that to open. So let's continue. Uh, here, in the first section, you're going to type here uh, the name of your research. So, for example, this research is Renorial Tendencies. So in your description, copy this, paste it here, Do some few edits here, enter, and enter. Okay, so this is the first section. Okay, it's the first section. Now let's go to the second section. You click Add Section. You copy here, this one, okay, paste it here again. So the title of this is the informed consent. Okay, so just, uh, some few edits here. Okay, so here in the entitled question, so I agree with the statements above and participate in this survey. Change this to agree. So this is where the question, the respondents will agree, no? so give the, their consent to join the survey. And check this required. Okay, so they have now two sections, the first section and the second section. Let's go now to the third section, add section again. So this is the this will be now your main questionnaire. This personal profile. Copy and then paste it here. And then you just uh this one, this is for the description. In the description, you can put the uh, introduction about the section, or you can also put instructions on how to answer this section. So this time we'll add question. Okay, so the questions here, you're going to add what is your gender. So we can just put there what is your gender. Ah, sorry, this will be here in the question. And here, I suggest uh, you put a coding. One for male, two for female. So 
this is main, this is one, and this is two. So this is very important because um, coding will be easy when you transfer it in Excel or in SPSS. So click required. This means that the respondents will choose either one for male and two for female. So I'll, I will not anymore add the second item. Um, when you, in your end, when you add items here, it's the same process. So I'll now go to the next section for process of illustration. So add section again. So this is about intention. So you write here the instruction in the description. Then let's add a question. So the first is... Let's add it here, copy, paste it here. So this time we're going to use a different type of choice, which is the linear scale. It's very useful when, you, when your type is a scaling survey. So this is six. Let's change this since there are six items. We type here just the lowest and the highest. So the lowest one is completely disagree and number six is completely agree completely agree again click required okay so it's the first item let's add the second item click add again add question okay, so the second just copy and paste it here so the Google Forms is smart. No? It will automatically um, copy the type of question here and the next question. So it, it is convenient for you. You will not be you not uh, you will not uh, choose again the type of question for your next set of items. So type completely disagree. And completely agree then check this required now this is very important required because uh, some respondents might skip the answering your items so when you turn this on they will be required to answer all the items in your survey questionnaire okay let, let's uh, check this out by clicking this preview Okay, this, uh, um, this is the first section. Okay, next. Okay, this is the informed consent. Okay. Next, this is the first item in the personal profile. Okay, these are the two items in your uh, intention. Okay, so it looks good. So it is all for today. I hope that you have learned uh, how to transfer from your MS Word here, questionnaire that you created in MS Word, and transfer it to Google Forms. So after you finish this, then the next video, uh, I will teach you how to send this to your respondents so that uh, you can now gather data for your research. Thank you. God bless. Um, please create your questionnaire first here in MS Word prior to transferring it in Google Forms. Goodbye!